art lovers, welcome to Building with Brandon. I'm Brandon Anuzi, Building Manager of the Minetti Trim Museum. Even though we can't be at the museum right now, that's not going to stop us from bringing the museum to you. This week we're going to build a time capsule in honor of artist Steve Kaltenbach, one of my personal favorites, whose exhibit, The Beginning and the End, is social distancing itself right now at the museum. Steve is an artist who lives in Davis. His art explores ideas like time and concealment, which basically means to cover something up or make it a secret. One thing he's known for is his time capsules. What is a time capsule exactly? Well, glad you asked. Time capsule is a container that you put stuff in, leave it closed for a long time, and then open it in the future to discover moments of your past. Steve would sometimes send these time capsules to his artist friends. Can you imagine getting a time capsule in the mail? All I ever get in the mail is, well, bills and if I'm lucky, the occasional booklet of coupons. But enough of me, back to Steve. One of the most mysterious parts of his time capsules is, well, nobody knows what's in them or whether they will ever be opened. Check this one out. Now that's what I call a time capsule. I love the detail and finish work on the stainless steel. All right, everyone, now let's get started. Here's some materials we need to grab. Toilet paper tube, tape, marker, paper, and scissors. Now remember, Safety first. Whenever you're using scissors or a sharp object, make sure you have an adult present to help you. Now let's dive into this. Step one, make four equal length cuts, about an inch long, with each cut directly across from each other. I already pre-marked mine, as you can see. Roughly an inch. Grab my scissors. Inch, inch. All right, now for step two. All right, step two, fold each section towards the center and use pieces of tape to seal the end of the tube. One, one, you can see. Use some tape to help seal it up. All right. Some tape on the perimeter to seal it up real well. Now that we have one end sealed up, let's go and repeat step one for the other side. And cut on the opposite side. All right, now that we have that wrapped up, go and put me on pause and go grab the items you want to put in your time capsule. All right, did you gather your items? Remember to keep them a secret, add a little mystery. Do you want to know why I'm putting it in my time capsule? I just told you. I can't tell you, it's a secret. Now let's do this. Turn your time capsule so that the sealed end is down. Place your secret item or items in the time capsule. Keep holding the capsule with the sealed end down. Close the other end by folding each section towards the center and use pieces of tape to seal it. So, just gonna do like so, fold each end in. Now time for tape. Did you finish taping it? How's it looking? Now feel free to design your capsule, draw, write, add stickers, anything you do to jazz it up. Make it unique, make it your own. After you're done designing, remember to write down when it should be open on the outside of your time capsule. Remember, Steve said, open after January 1st, 2025. Mine says, I'm gonna open this time capsule up after our first 100 likes on this video. So don't forget to like the video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Can't wait to see you again on our next installment of Building with Brandon from the Minetti Shrem Museum at Home.